So you were saying about the expectations and modulating your pace based on what rotations you are on. What resources did you find particularly valuable for different study aids? That's half the battle. I have a really hard time learning from books alone. I'm probably not alone in the experience of having a hard time achieving deep, deep focus when I'm exhausted or studying in the hospital. So I tend to be less a book chapter guy and more a find ways to make studying loud and flashy kind of guy. Early on, I benefit a lot from video lectures. The UCSF COVID series is really great, as is the Empire Urology one. I think when you're approaching a topic the first time, it's really helpful to hear someone talking about it. You think about things that you don't see in your early residency. There's so many variables of varying importance, but when you hear an expert talk about their thought process for the first time of working up a patient, you implicitly pick up on the hierarchy of facts, what's most important versus what may be incidental. And that helps you prioritize your knowledge within a topic, which I think is an underrated first step in all of this. 